what makes uh, Namibia so unique uh, to the extent that uh, they have had two presidents who have served their term and left and now you have the third uh, president. What makes their story so different? Having had two presidents serving and uh, one of them obviously, uh, Sam Nyoma as a founding president and someone that uh, is regarded as uh, the father of the nation, obviously because he was the pioneer president and uh, really struggled and fought for it. Uh, the second one, uh, uh, Pohamba, uh, actually perhaps you could refer to him as uh, a president who played the role of a servant leader of sorts. Now, Namibia has been independent for the last 26 years. If you are a country like Angola, for example, which has had uh, Jose dos Santos since 1979, if you are someone from Equatorial Guinea, where you have uh, Theodore Obiang Nguema Basogo, who also has been, in fact, in office since 1979. If you are a person from the Republic of Cameroon, where you have uh, Paul Obia, who has been in office since 1982. If you are from Zimbabwe, for example, where you have a Robert Gabriel Mugabe, who has been in office since 1980, the first eight years as prime minister and head of government, and of course after that as president. Mm -hmm. If you are from another country called Uganda, for example, where you have Yoweri Museveni, who has been in office since 1986 and still counting on, uh, then of course you have to appreciate the fact that here is a new African nation, new in relative terms, which has been independent for 26 years. And within those 26 years, it now has a third president in his second year of service, then of course you can tell the difference.